Hey, this is Chris Lipe from Jamplay.com, and welcome to another episode of Lipe's Licks. Get a new lick every Thursday. This one is going to be based off of some sweet picking arpeggios. A lot of players have trouble putting sweet picking into their playing, putting those arpeggios that kind of cross a bunch of strings at once, because they're kind of boxes in and of themselves. And this lick is going to give you one way to really put it in in time and combine it with some other licks. So we start with a E minor 7 arpeggio. Okay? You may have seen this on another one of the licks that I've taught, but this arpeggio is only going to function as our upward vehicle. All right? Okay, so we're going to go pick, hammer on, downstroke, upstroke. All right? Instead of going back down that though, we're going to slide up two frets, pull off, and we're going to go down a different version of the E minor arpeggio. So we start here on that E minor 7, slide up, and then we add that nice little tasteful thing at the end. So, here we go. Now, when you're playing it slow, it's hard to discipline your hand to make those downs and those ups kind of one motion. But you still want to try to do it. Notice when I'm doing that, I'm not going... I'm not doing that. Of course, I'm really exaggerating. But you want to make sure that it's a fluid motion. That's where sweet picking really, really kind of has its, its main advantage is that you're, you're doing one motion up or down and then, then the other direction. So it's a pretty fluid lick even at that slower tempo. Bring this around to a couple different places on the neck. Uh, the backing track that is still, we're still using the same one, E to F sharp you're going to be in these two positions. But to a metronome, go ahead and, and move it around. And experiment with it, because this lick is great in a lot of different settings. Okay, you can, you can follow it with, with some licks of your own, or approach it with a lick of your own, but it's kind of a musical phrase in and of itself, and it's using sweet picking arpeggios. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by playing at a tempo of 75 beats per minute, and I'm just going to play this in a variety of different areas around the neck, and help you get a feel for how it, how it sits with a slower tempo. A lot of times these licks are, are much easier to play at slower tempos, but once you've learned it at a faster tempo, it can actually be hard to, to slow down that sweet picking hand. Sweet picking is all about hand sync. These two guys move in at the same time. So check it out over 75 beats per minute. <laughs> Go to 85. And finally, let's go to 95. Thanks for checking out another episode of Lipe's Licks. Make sure you download the backing track, and if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. See you soon.